fascinating places our ghost ship can take us. Um, one of them being an island to the south. Um, I think slightly to the southeast of here, mainly to the south of uh, Kata City. Like if we keep sailing this direction, we should come to yeah this little island. Hell yeah, we are gonna depart. This is called the Island of Bronze. Puzzle Island, yeah. To an old cult. Fans more like it. Cult is a strong bird. They're still here, doubt it, but you never know. So Alex claims, but it is, as a matter of fact, our next destination in the main quest. We might as well, yes. So there are basically two buildings on this island. Uh, one we'll come across in just a second. What's over there? Oh, already I'm getting distracted. All the enemies here are afraid of us. So, yeah, no, we, we won't encounter any strong monsters here. Anyway, if you follow the road, we will come across this house. And uh, in this house, we find a woman. Oh, visitors. I thought I heard something. Are you here for the Temple of Bronze? Uh, I guess so. Sure, of course. What do you want to know? The basics, I guess. A very informal place, not meant for the uneducated, but in order to get inside, you need a puzzle piece. And I just happen to have one. In fact, I have multiple. Although, I don't think that many. A puzzle piece can find them all around the world. The poet of bronze has puzzles guarding each one. She goes around and resets everything once every ten years. And as of a few days ago, the puzzle have reset. Interesting, yeah, good news though. Apparently someone had fixed the divine tower recently, so I can order some pieces for you. They'll be very expensive, so I only recommend buying them when they're already inside. And also to buy them when you don't know where any more puzzles can be found, you know, as a last resort. What's your name, by the way? Diane. Which, uh, if you've paid attention to the lore, which, if you haven't, I don't blame you either, <laughs> is the name of the Poet of Bronze. So, um, yeah. Uh, this is the person responsible for all the puzzles around. But, you know, let's not think of worse of her for that. Uh, she is not the reason we are here anyways. The reason we are here is the nearby temple. Although we might as well show, uh, check out all the stuff on the side. Yes, a plus one in population. This connects back to the road. This goes huh, behind the temple. Behind the temple. There are two chests here. One of which is a mimic, it turns out. A king mimic, even, and a virus. What a piece of shit! Anyway, hamstring this thing. Impale this jerk. Fire strike him, lunge at him, set him on fire. And, uh, yeah, that's all for those. 
oxygen spare. Cool. <laughs> Not gonna use it, but you know, in principle, it's cool. And yeah, this goes back here. Which means we've seen almost all of this because they should go back to the road. So all that's left is a little path to the south. Right here. Which shouldn't be leading to too much. No. No. We are here for the temple. For one, we have a side quest here concerning... Um, all right, the bartender in Ghost Town. One of the things he asked us to do. We are told to uh, tell the barman here something. This place is not like the other temples. You'll need to collect puzzle pieces to prove your worth. Otherwise, you won't have much to see. I have a few. Temple of Bronze is great, but it's not as good as Temple of Gold. It's far better than Silvers. Ah, Silvers. That guy is something else. Everyone hates him except his loyal followers. Hence why no one knows where he is. Not even his followers. So, the barman. Yeah, the Apollo guy. Philip? Hmm. I'm sure he didn't. Mm hmm. Exactly. There were more than one. Nope. Yeah, we know. But I think we're square. Thank you. It would have been a dick move. There is a puzzle piece in that. Good for you. How many of those do we have overall? Should be a key item. Ten! Not bad. No, oh, the journal stays in our album even if we've already given it to Leon in the ghost town. Yeah, I wish I had more too. I have ten. In the far northeast, he lives in a frozen wasteland called Frozen Ocean. Yeah, where wooden edge connects. Hmm. Yeah, that's for much later. Chase, this, chase, this giant basin we're in is where all the monsters in the sector live. They're usually nothing to worry about, especially on this island, but something is making them stronger. The pentagram scattered about. Well, there's not one on this island. That is for sure. Don't tell anyone this, but I like the pot of silver. Well, you're just pretentious fucks. They don't appreciate the surreal greatness. Okay, I'm not judging you. Well, I am judging you, but I'm doing it silently. Anyway, we're supposed to go downstairs. Over half of this place is locked behind doors. The more pieces you have on you, the more you can go through. Uh, true. I might go out and get some pieces this year. I've always been curious about what's behind the 25 door. Yeah, I think there are overall 25. Um... 25 temples. This will eventually lead to a ghost town, but you need to access it from the other side. And this, of course, is where the tunnel that goes from the mines, like the Star Cave, eventually connects to. This door is pretty well stocked there, but it's not the only one here. No, there are supposedly other ones if you have enough puzzle pieces. The shopkeeper is invisible. Radiation swords. Artisan radiation swords. Scissors, Enigma Sickle, Enigma Spear. Not too bad. I think I'm doing fine with my current equipment. This is the most basic store here. The other rooms sell things far greater than this place. Only came here for the potions, to be honest. 
And you know, I mean, it's nice that this connects to the ghost town. I just don't see any benefit from going through the dangerous ass cave as compared to just taking the ship here. But that's something you can do. Is that a hotel? There's a large city to the south I always wanted to visit. Lasik, I think it's called. But sadly, us ghosts aren't allowed to visit. Damn rules. The place sure looks cool from the ocean, though. I think that city is not yet accessible in this game. Hey, get away from my stuff. I know you hero types. You ain't taking my stuff. Take theirs, I don't care. Fine. If I have your express permission, I won't say no to it. Probably not the express permission of whoever owns that stuff, but... Not my problem. So yeah, with ten of them I can probably... Oh. Go here to this teleport crystal. Now twenty... That is... Still a bit too much. But at least this is now connect teleport network. This way leads to a dangerous dungeon. Very dangerous. Enter at your own risk. Uh, doesn't everything. The abstract passage. Mm, we do not have any reason to be here. Mm, puzzle pieces 5. Yes. There's another invisible shopkeeper here. He sells armor. Yeah, nothing too great. Demons love being merchants for some reason. Don't know if this says more about demons or more about merchants. And just this glowy. AP soul. Nice. I think it... Yeah, does exactly what you'd think it does. Increases our AP. Now is there also one for ten? This one, maybe? No, this is for seven. Elite nether armor. They actually sell Ikimo scale here. They will have a nice day. So you get AP here and increasingly exclusive shops. Not only does Ghost Road lead to the island of Sand in the east, it also can lead to Lasik City in the south, where ghosts are not allowed, presumably. But be warned, it's an extremely long walk. If you want to go to those places, I just have sailing. But then again, what's life without a little adventure? Hmm. Yeah, Ghost Road is where we, we want to go. Also, let's eat our candies. Bitter candy, what did it do again? Free permanent HP. Sweet candy, one permanent MP. No point in giving it to Alex, considering we never make him use magic. Well, we barely make him use magic. Sure, let's give him one. Spicy candy, one permanent strength. Sour candy, one permanent magic. And hard candy, one permanent defense. That is something we can give to Alex. Is there really no 10 puzzle pieces room in here? Yeah, 5, 7... What's to the right of here, anyways? 20, yeah. This opens up as we come here from the other side. Don't die, not 
planning to. This leads to a dungeon. Uh, yeah, no, it doesn't seem to. Oh, no, there's more. <laughs> Here we are, one for ten. Corlevain. Demon wings. Superior demon wings. Red prophet. Really expensive stuff. Really expensive stuff. And more AP. Also some what appears to be religious insignia. But that's not what we're here for. And this is for 25. Oh, the final one. Uh, but no, we're going south. To ghost roads. Now, once upon a time, an earlier version of this game had chapters, and the chapter you get after the Divine Tower was actually called Ghost Road. So, yeah, this is officially where we are supposed to be next. Oh, show the guy who sells keys. You probably didn't remember that. I am Witch. I am Reason. No doubt it's. Shoal don't sell keys here. Shoal need to kill monster. Kill monster? Kill monster! Shoal has been tasked. Can I help Shoal? Yes! One can sink with ghost town. Very good. Two golems do sound very deadly. Shoal happy. Let's get to work. Um, what is... Oh, Shoal is actually a party member. Level 60. Impressive. The Golem Great Sword, but we can give him a Golem Sword free. Which should be slightly more powerful. So, what is. Sholem? Fucking Sholem. He's not done the flinch. Uh, but what does Sholem himself have on him? Master Devil Teeth, Elite Hotel Leather, and Rules of Law. Should be pretty powerful. Road Warrior. Oh, I get it. And some Fire Worms. Let's knock him down. Let's strike him. Poison arrow him. Why has that golem such low HP? I don't know, but I feel like we should probably rectify that. Why does Shoal have such low HP? Questions, questions. Um, Eviscerate. Fire and impale at him. Use an electric strike on him. He leaves one guy. He is dead. Great. Nothing too scary should be on this road. Other than some slightly hard to see enemies. We near bridge. Heart of ghost roads. More monsters ahead. Demon too. Demon? Dimensional demon. Well, we beat one of those at the hotel. Yes. No, Divine Tower, exactly. Yes. No? He was. We do. Haven't seen him in a while. 
defeat the dimensional demon, all monsters go away. That does sound good. Very good indeed. I do like the old monsters go away part. Like those guys we are very likely to accidentally run into. Yeah, I want them to go away. Natanite, Road Warrior, Smiley. God, Smiley looks creepy as hell. Set this guy on fire. Try to hamstring him. Use an impale on him. And. Eh, heavy swim. No, okay. And that's that. There is, of course, more. But for now, that was that. A plasmic turtle, an ice worm, a fire worm. Uh, cool. We should be able to knock it over. It's a turtle, so that should harm it pretty bad. Victory reward. Well, that's what they say to the victor comes to spoils. And I'm feeling very spoiled right now. Shoulder eyes off. Good. And here should be our dimensional demon. You aren't the same one as the one from the tower, are you? No. The reason you don't notice me, my ritual, wake up my first element. Oh, that happened before the beginning of the game. No. Oh, so you are the one from the tower. Memory crystals. Good. I don't think this guy was hostile. We should hear him out. No escape then, okay. Huh. Well, okay. I am not sure if this guy is harder than the one at the hotel, but... Um, well, only one way to find out. Seems not too bad. Maybe using third life would be worth it. Oh, no, not necessary. He's as good as dead. And in a second he will be more than just as good as. Hmm. Almost at level 40, sweet. 
Dimensional Shield Sweet. He is. Do I kind of wonder what he was on about when we talked to him? Job done. Shoulder sensing right now. One second. Entire ghost road is now clear. The monsters have left. And the darkness subsides. Minus two enemy tech. You're welcome. Hmm, puzzle piece. Uh, sure. It was very fancy. The demon. Well, kind of both. Apparently he did. Yes. Not really anything to follow up on. If you want to keep it that simple, sure. Let's just go. So, where are we now? Yeah, it was really crazy out there. Yeah, float. Hover, sure. So this here should be a town. I don't think there are many more books we can read. Facts of Knowledge, Volume 2, Shiba the uh -huh, I know. Oh, Tower of Babel, I know that too. This building seems to be empty, except for a bunch of bookshelves. Oh wow, do they have full tips of the Gammac series? What? Waste of time? Boring series I read before. Waste of time. <laughs> Not gonna read something I already read. Trash books, trash knowledge, useless reading. No point in reading. <laughs> if only you would have told us that earlier. Okay, this is a thing. I guess we have all re read all the books we are ever gonna read. Fine. So let's just follow Ghost Road then. I know, it was pretty sick, wasn't it? We are really strong. You're welcome. Is then Suedo Heaven doing nothing but Pseudo Heaven? The guys are not as strong as they say they are. Worthless. Oh, I'd love to. And then we'd show that other angel what's what. We are totally amazing. <laughs> well, feast your eyes on it. Well, we had two golems helping us. Pure you are. Well, it is. Yep. The most important people around here. I bet we are. Murder. So. Ooh, flavor restaurant. Sure, let's get some crab. Wait a second, is this what I think it is? Is it? What are you talking about? Well, knock yourselves out. They did. I don't know either. So, what's going on in here? Yes, they are! I'm not sure if they were official or not, but uh, they're gone. It's fine. 
What's going on in the kitchen in here? Mm -hmm. The usual. Oh. Well, delicious. Maybe. Oh, of course. Whatever that is. No, of course not. Ah. Well, how convenient you should become a chef. Oh, I see. But they are demons. Oh, come on, most of the time you're pretty sweet. I know. Mm -hmm. Oh, come on. We've been traveling together how long? He is very rude. Those are fighting birds. Upstairs, okay. Oh, nice. Thank you. I know. Yeah. Fucking liberals. Not wanting to eat children. What will they come for next? And it seems like such a nice restaurant too. It is incredibly unique. Ah, does it now? Oh yes. Oh, so this is the only place where you can become this powerful. Purgatory or below. Hmm. Yeah, didn't take us for a local, did he? No, he doesn't look like a ghost. Oh, it's Roland. Um, Burke. Oh, you know. Oh, she seemed alright. Yes. I know. I know. That is so sweet of you. So, is pseudo heaven. Like, is pseudo heaven. Above pseudo heaven. Are we finally going to get an answer to that? Suedo is you are and pseudo is are you are. Which, if I'm reading the like lore of this game correctly, like realistic, unrealistic reality is like a simulation. Unrealistic reality is real, but it's also like not quite. It's sort of a layer of reality that's more really changeable, kinda. Uh huh. All theatrics, okay. State and federal governments, with big R on top as the global one. Well, I mean, yeah, no, I get that. There's reality, then there's unrealistic reality. And then there's realistic and it's complicated. Yeah, realistic. R, R, U, R, U, R, and just R, or as people call it, Big R. They're the actual creators of the hotel, and by far the most powerful. Very few have ever seen them. Though that angel that we've encountered seems to have been real. 
uh, representatives for court cases. What kind of court cases? The one my brother is involved in, isn't it? Yes, please. No, but I would like to. I'm genuinely interested. Yeah, but I couldn't handle the angel there. Exactly. I take care, yes. And there he teleports away. Habit. I was about to say he probably went further away, but no. He said he wanted to take to talk to the people here. So sure, let's go to sleep. I guess it is. It's a pretty long day. Mm-hmm. Without too much trouble. Yes. Yes. We were. I'm pretty sure we would have even managed to defeat him if it hadn't been for the golems and the hotel employee. Do I mean, I admit he helped. Practice. Those are the RPG mechanics that one ghost was talking about. Mm-hmm. Are you our demons? Hmm. Well, are you complaining? And same for Violet. To Mesra and Marcus. She does. Complains huh. about the menu, yet it's two elements. <laughs> well, I'm not sure if it's bad, but it seems to be very uncommon. Oh, please do. But of course, we are not being filled in. Why would we be? I feel... strange. Well, this sure is... not the place we fell asleep in. Matter of fact, this appears to be the hotel. The Infinite Hotel. Matter of fact, this appears to be very similar to the place that Simon ended up in in the intro. Am I dreaming? And are there going to be enemies in this dream? She left you, yet you killed her. You know what they are, yet you enable them. I guess first was probably referring to Violet's mother. Second one, very likely to Alex and Amelia. Alex wants to fuck you, so let him. He seems to want to, yes. Amelia is useless, so use her. I uh, don't like what these flowers are suggesting, if flowers is what they are. Your son is dead, so stop looking. Son. My son, eh? I think I already talked to that one. <clears throat> that one too. I would rather like to not miss out on any of them. But does seem to be all around here. Huh. 
Hello. Hey kid, can you hear me? You must practice. What? You must become immune. I can't let her down. Is that Marcus? Are your parents around? I'm realistically unrealistically real. <laughs> Simon. Simon. Yeah, seems very familiar, doesn't it? Yes. You gotta leave. She won't be happy if she finds you. You're pretty, so she'll be jealous. The lady in the portrait behind you? Who will be jealous? My angel. We talking real? You are or you are? Her. She's right. I am a monster. I can't stop, but I don't want to. What is wrong with me? What is wrong with us? What is wrong with her? You guys sleep good. Yeah. Murder, murder. That's good. By the way, shouldn't we go save your brother or something? Uh, we weren't ready for it. No, it isn't. Yes, it is. We are... Yes. Okay, okay. We'll start heading back up north again. That said, let's stop by Simon's mansion. There's something I need to ask him. Like what? I don't know, I just... You'll find out when we get there. It'll make more sense than me explaining it. I just got some questions is all. What do you mean, you always have questions? Yeah, I just... I got some new ones. Just trust me. Hm. All right then. I guess that would be our next clear destination for the main quest. Finding Simon. Um, but you know how we do it. We, we don't do it like that. Go away, fine. We find other things to waste our time on, and there are still plenty of those. <laughs>